Though there are many notable Dr. Phil guests in its long history, one of the most remembered is Destony, who faced some severe anger issues that scared her family. While Dr. Phil McGraw holds a doctorate in clinical psychology, he doesn't keep up his license to practice psychology on his own. Despite letting his credentials lapse, Dr. Phil has been one of the longest-running daytime talk shows in the last several decades, running for 21 seasons. As the show has continued on, Dr. Phil has continually brought guests onto the series who truly need psychological intervention and done his best to help where he can, providing resources when possible. Destony, who was one of Dr. Phil's most well-known guests throughout the run of the series, had some serious anger issues when Dr. Phil met with her at age 14. Destona's mother, Melissa, brought her onto the show in order to have drive. Phil intervened with Destona's anger issues. Destoni explained that she felt her mother never listened, and that the impact of losing her father at a young age really triggered her. She didn't feel that her mother would allow her to speak on the things troubling her, and instead acted out. Unfortunately, Destona's rage was getting dangerous and causing the people around her to fear for their safety. Destony touched base with Dr. Phil after her appearance on the show. Destona's appearance on the series was incredibly memorable, so much so that Dr. Phil reached out to see how she was doing after she was on the show. In 2022, Drive. Phil talked to Destony about her progress, and found that she's in a residential treatment center. The two discussed her anger management, and Destony explained that she has been taking classes and doing the work in order to keep her anger under control. The therapeutic methods Dr. Phil suggested have been helpful for Destony, and she was doing a lot better than when he first met with her at the peak of her issues. Why no one can forget Destonis Dr. Phil appearance Destonis Dr. Phil appearance is memorable for an array of reasons, but mainly because her problems were tremendously severe. While it seemed like the show was angling to blame Destonis issues on her rage, it did seem interesting to note that Destony was trying to explain where her anger came from in a fairly coherent manner for a young teenager. Destony lost a parent at a young age, and that changed her life tremendously. Seemingly without an outlet for her grief or a parent who she felt comfortable sharing her feelings with, Destony turned to violence and allowed her rage to take over. Was Destony just immature? Though she was framed as an incredibly dangerous, violent individual on Dr. Phil, Destony was likely just a young person who was struggling with handling her emotions. There was no clinical diagnosis provided for Destony, but it's clear that she was trying to cope with some major emotional distress. While violence wasn't a healthy method of coping, it's clear that Destony didn't feel she had any other choice given her family situation and the outlets she had for her anger. Her appearance on the show, while brief, was notable for both the audience and Destony, whose life seemed to change after getting the help she needed. Sources. Ton Legend. YouTube. FTV Studios. YouTube. Dr. Phil. Twitter. Yeah.